Juvenile diabetes is becoming a growing concern across the country, according to the Centers for Disease Control. Doctors diagnosed more than 200,000 children and teens with diabetes in 2018. Dana Smith has more on how people here in Hampton Roads are raising money and raising awareness for the cause. Scarlett Peterson is your average 11 year old girl, but there's something a lot of people who meet her may not know about her. I have type 1 diabetes. At first it was a lot, but I've kind of gotten used to uh, the way things work with type 1 diabetes. She and her family were among the dozens of others taking part in a big fundraising event by the Juvenile Diabetes Research Foundation, or JDRF. Scarlett's mom, Amanda Torres, said the fundraiser is also about raising awareness. As people associate diabetes with an unhealthy lifestyle or being overweight or what have you, but um, it's, it's not that. For type 1 diabetics, their pancreas just stops producing insulin and we need insulin to live. Families are taking part in something called the 365 No Days Off Challenge. Participants are raising money for juvenile diabetes research, but must also stay active by running, walking, hiking, or swimming. People with diabetes don't ever get a day off, so the idea is for five days, um, we get out there and we run and we never take a day off from exercising and promoting a healthy lifestyle. Living with a chronic disease like diabetes isn't always easy, but Scarlett has some sound advice for any children who may face this unexpected diagnosis. Your parents, your caregiver, they will help you through this. My mom was a big part of helping me get through this. Uh, she was always there for me when I cried, when I was upset. She was there for me. Dana Smith, 13 News Now. What a great ambassador she is. If you want to donate money for juvenile diabetes research, we have a link on our website. Visit 13newsnow.com and search diabetes.